potato gnocchi in tomato sauce. Ingredients 2 and a half pounds russet potatoes, about 4. 1 egg. 1 teaspoon salt. Pinch freshly grated nutmeg. 1 to 1 and a half cups all-purpose flour. 1 fourth cup grated parmesan, plus more for serving. Handful of fresh basil leaves, about 1 fourth cup, for garnish. Tomato sauce. 2 tablespoons extra virgin olive oil. 1 medium yellow onion, roughly chopped into even pieces. 2 cloves garlic, minced. 1 teaspoon dried oregano. 1 teaspoon red chili flakes. 2 tablespoons tomato paste. Half cup red wine. 1 teaspoon kosher salt. Freshly ground black pepper. 2, 28 ounce, cans whole plum tomatoes. 2 tablespoons red wine vinegar. 1 fourth to half cup grated parmesan. Directions. Bake potatoes in a 350 degrees Fahrenheit oven until tender. When cool enough to handle scoop out the insides and put through a ricer to eliminate any lumps. In a small bowl combine the egg, salt and nutmeg. On a lightly floured work surface mound the potatoes making a well in the center. Pour in the egg mixture then, using your fingers or a fork, begin to mix the eggs into the potatoes working from the outside and as to not break the moat. When eggs are about halfway combined begin to sprinkle a bit of the flour and cheese over the potatoes, continuing to lightly knead, bringing the mixture together adding more flour as needed to make a pliable dough. Once the dough is no longer sticky the dough is done. It is important not to overwork the dough creating gluten giving the dough a dense texture. Working quickly and lightly will give you light, airy gnocchi. Dust the board with flour and roll one fourth of the dough into a long rope about one inch thick. Cut into thumb size sections and set aside, tossing with a bit of flour. To avoid them from sticking together, repeat with the other pieces of dough. Using the back of a fork, take each gnocchi and gently roll over the tines by lightly pressing with your thumb and allowing the gnocchi to fall off the fork. Boil gnocchi in a large pot of salted water until they float. When they float, they are done. Remove and toss immediately with spicy tomato sauce. Garnish with torn basil leaves and additional cheese. In a large sauce pot over medium high heat add olive oil. Add onions and saute until softened, about 3 minutes. Add garlic and saute until fragrant. Add oregano, chili flakes and tomato paste, stir until combined and paste cooks into the mixture, about 1 minute. Add red wine. Stirring until almost completely evaporated. Season with kosher salt, pepper, to taste, and tomatoes using the back of a spoon to break up the tomatoes. Bring to a boil then reduce to a simmer and allow to cook down about 20 minutes. Taste the sauce and add red wine vinegar, cheese and additional salt and pepper, if needed. If desired you may puree the sauce at this point using an immersion blender or keep it chunky. Serve with gnocchi.